Hey, what is going on guys? So here's my new LG Smart TV that I had about two weeks. Has 4K Ultra HD. This is the 2018 model. Now I got the 43 inch, but it also comes in 49, 55, and 65 inch as well. For this 43 inch, I paid $269.99. I think this is the best bang for the buck. The first thing I wanna mention is on the Amazon site, it doesn't say that it has Bluetooth functionality. However, it does, and I'll show you that in one second. It comes with this remote here, nice and responsive. The picture quality is actually quite decent. Two AA batteries do come with the remote as well. And if I press the home button here, you can see the pre-installed apps on here. You can see Live TV, Netflix, Amazon, Prime Video, Hulu, Sling, and all the way down here as well. It's actually quite light as well as you can see here. You can see the thickness of it. We can see the size of the bezel here. We have these stands on the bottom here, which basically just takes one screw. Now looking on the back of the TV here, we have three USB ports here, one here and two here on the side. We have two USB ports, one here and one here. We have a optical port here, ethernet, RCA jacks, and your cable connection here as well. Also on the bottom of the TV, right under the LG logo, if you look under here, we have the power button where you can basically control everything if you lose your remote. Now let me prove to you that there is Bluetooth on here. And from here, let me go to sound here. And then let me move over to the right. And now it says right here, sound out. Right now it's on internal speaker. Now if I go ahead and press on enter, now this pops up here as well. And you can see that the Bluetooth here is grayed out. The reason why it's grayed out is because you need to first pair it with your Bluetooth sound bar or any Bluetooth device. For instance, I went up and hooked up my Bluetooth headphones right here. So once I turn these on, you can see here now it's asking me if I want to pair these pair of uh, Bluetooth headphones. And once I select yes, now you can see the Bluetooth is in color. Now let me show you the picture quality on this. Also, I do have some sunlight coming in directly from my window here. And I'll go ahead and raise the volume. That's about midpoint right there. Let me go ahead and lower this up. And again, I do have some sun directly coming in through this window right here. Let me give you like a side view here. Just like this. And let me also go ahead and close the blinds. And I'll go ahead and raise the volume up a little bit more again. I mean, I mean, honestly, for internal speakers, this is actually quite good. Definitely better than my Samsung Smart TV where I actually had to get a sound bar. This one here, I'm perfectly fine just using the internal speakers. Now I just shut these off. I had these uh, fluorescent lights here in the office above. I just like shut them off. And right here I'm playing Flash. I do believe that this show plays in 4K. Now this is what I want to show you next. Of course, I have the TV hooked up to the uh, Wi-Fi internet here. I want to go ahead and cast some apps from my phone and I also want to do a screen mirror. Now let me do this. Let me go ahead and grab my phone here and what I want to do is go ahead and cast an app. Let me just go ahead and cast a YouTube app here. And any smartphone that is hooked up to the same Wi-Fi as your LG TV, they'll be able to cast many apps directly from their phone. I'm also going to do a screen mirror. I'll show you photos and videos directly from my phone. But let me go ahead and cast uh, one of my YouTube videos here. I'll go ahead and cast this video here and you see the casting icon. Let me go ahead and tap on that. And right away, you can see that it finds my LG TV right here. So let me tap on that. We're going to go ahead and give this a second. Now the volume and everything, of course, is going to come directly from the TV. All right, so it's casting from my phone here. It doesn't matter if it's an Android or an iPhone, okay? As long as you have both devices connected to the same Wi-Fi. So I can go ahead and increase my volume here from my phone. Of course, the volume comes directly out from the TV. And then from here, you can go ahead and like fast forward. You can go ahead and pause. You can go ahead and switch to like other videos, whatnot. All right, so the next thing here, what I'm gonna do is a screen mirror. So everything on my phone is gonna be exactly the same way on my TV. Now this is different from actually casting. If you're screen mirroring, everything on your phone, exactly the way it is, is gonna be the exact same image on your TV. And what's cool about that, especially if you have like photos and videos that you wanna show family and friends to like a group, you could basically mirror it from your phone onto the big screen TV. And let me give you a quick example how to hook this up and I'll show you some photos and videos. Now the screen mirroring will only work on certain Android phones that support screen mirroring or in other words, mirror cast. And by the way, I'm using a Samsung Galaxy S8, but if you have like the uh, S5 and up, it does support screen mirroring. And other different brand phones may call it something different. You know, some of it call it, like this one here, they'll call it Smart View. Some call it Cast Screen. Others call it All Share. They make it all confusing. Here. So basically what you wanna do is just go somewhere on your, on your TV, on your LG TV where it says Screen Share. Tap on that. 
then this will pop up and simply go ahead and grab your mobile phone that supports screen mirroring. And for this Samsung Galaxy S8 here, they actually call it Smart View. So let me go down here, let me swipe to the right, and this one here says Smart View. As you can see right there, I'm going to go ahead and tap on that. And then, and now you can see it automatically connects directly to my phone. So everything that I do on my phone is going to show up here. So from here, even if I open up like a browser, I mean, you'll be able to see everything. You can see this here, and I can even turn it into a uh, landscape mode here. And you can see this is great for even doing like business presentations and stuff like that, that you want to hook up uh, screen mirror wirelessly documents and stuff from your phone directly onto a, your LG TV. Even if I turn my camera on here, let me turn my camera on and we can see right there. Let me go ahead and take a quick test video here. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. Let me go ahead and stop it. And let me also take a quick test photo here. Let me take a photo of this uh, remote right here. And now let me go into my photos gallery on my phone here, right here. And here's the photo I just took. And you can like zoom in and out. And let me show you the video as well. If you have videos on your phone, once you play it, of course, the volume will come out directly from the TV as well. Let me go ahead and show you that test footage. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. Let me. Okay, so there you guys go. You guys pretty much got the message. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.